Hey guys, it's that Devin guy coming at you with a quick little update here. So I wanted to make sure that I showed you guys because I forgot to show you when I did the AV buy. I did transfer the 500 over for the month. Um, so I deposited 500 bucks over and instant transferred. So I had 500 bucks um, to play with. Then instead of buying um, Realty Income and Pfizer like I wanted to, um, I went ahead and I bought um, Aflac because honestly I like it better. So uh, it's one of my favorites. So I bought uh, another 10 shares of Aflac adding $3.30 to my passive income meaning that we're above $100 again for that set of months for 369.12. And so I'm super excited about having more Aflac stock and uh, added 10 shares added three dollars and thirty cents to my passive income which means that we added three six nine twelve so about thirteen dollars more a year for our passive income so happy about that have more of the ducky company guys this is really what it's about it's about the consistency um, that's what's going to give us you know good returns over the long run is just transferring cash over and buying stocks on a frequent basis so I'm happy to add 10 more shares of Aflac and the reason that I, I that I decided to do that instead of buying Realty Income or buying Pfizer is because one this month was actually I was supposed to buy either um, Procter & Gamble or AbbVie but given that I just put uh, 14 shares into AbbVie I didn't want to add any more to that and I felt Procter & Gamble was a bit overvalued so or more overvalued than Aflac is right now so I went ahead and bought 15 shares of Aflac but the problem is I was supposed to buy Aflac next month so now I bought 15 shares of Aflac this month so next month I can go ahead and buy about 10 shares of Pfizer and add even more to my passive income so I already bought AbbVie I bought 14 shares of AbbVie this month already so now I have 74 shares, so that added to my passive. Well, it was supposed to. It didn't because I didn't buy it before the X date. But technically, I added to Abby before. And then I went ahead and I bought another 10 shares of Aflac, which added $3.30 to my passive income. So the next month, I'm planning on buying Pfizer, which will add um, around $4 to my passive income for the next month. So super excited, guys. I'm happy that I bought 10 more shares of Aflac. Let me know what stocks you've been buying lately. Um, it's always cool to see exactly what people are adding to the portfolio and why. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Remember to hit the subscribe button, the like button, the and the bell notifications so you stay up to date. Happy I added another 500 bucks to the portfolio and added 10 more shares of Aflac. Take care, guys.